This is the Financial News Network. I'm Shannon Ballard. Sears Holdings reported a first quarter loss of $1.39, wider than the consensus estimates of $1.22 per share. Revenues for the quarter rose 2.4% year-over-year to $9.71 billion, ahead of consensus estimates of $9.63 billion. Lou D'Ambrosio, Sears Holdings' chief executive officer and president, said, quote, Our first quarter was adversely impacted by unfavorable weather, economic pressures facing our customers, and comparisons to last year's government-sponsored stimulus programs relating to the purchase of appliances. However, we fell short on ex executing with excellence. We cannot control the weather or the economy or government spending, but we can control how we execute and leverage the potent set of assets we have. We are taking actions intended to leverage our suits of assets, including extending our leadership positions in appliances, capitalizing on the scope of our portfolio and marquee brands such as Kenmore, Craftsman, Die Hard, and Land's End, extending our lead in home services, revitalizing our Sears apparel business, and delivering an extraordinary customer experience at the store, online, and in home. Everything will begin and end with the customer experience. These actions will be complemented with effective expense management and operational excellence. For more updates, stay tuned. This is the Financial News Network. I'm Shannon Ballard.